the wedding. After the ceremony, we came down and Sophie threw the bouquet as you do as tradition. She threw it into the pond. I got told off. I got told off because of that. Sorry, you did the <laughs> So we both arrived on the same day. Yes, we did. Friday morning. You were staying at Palm Rock, which yeah. was where a lot of the groomsmen and bridesmaids were staying. Yeah. I was in a lovely Airbnb, which was actually in the middle of nowhere, but... It looked <laughs> also stunning. lovely, lovely with another bridesmaid. Izzy. Yeah, and then when we all came together, the first time was Trocadero for the evening before the wedding. Evening before the wedding, and it was such good vibes. Yeah. It's just like stunning weather, like out having drinks, like by this lovely pool. And then it was the morning of the wedding. So much wedding prep. Yeah. Guys. So we all, all the girls, all the bridesmaids met Sophie at Palm Rock at where you guys were staying. And before Jamie left, we got a little gift, didn't we, as bridesmaids? <gasps> he guys, he took us away separately and then gave us all these like diamond necklaces that have our initials on. That, Honestly. And like gave us like a mini speech. I like literally shed a tear. I was like, oh my God. Yeah. And then we also got letters from Soph as well. Like all of us, are ha- like a lovely handwritten letter. And they were really heartfelt, weren't they? Like really, they made us all cry. Everyone cried. And yeah. It was just a real really, really moment. gorgeous. Then, guys, we had to walk down the aisle. Obviously, but we had, did have the rehearsal mm. the day before. Yeah, we did. Thank God. I don't know how people just do it with no rehearsal. I mean, people, maybe people don't, but it was quite nerve-wracking yeah and we like fully acting like it's like choreographed routine we were like and one and two <laughs> no <laughs> also like we went at the wrong time there was like a bit of a cock up like no one noticed though but basically there was two different like wedding planners like one with Soph behind yeah. and then one sort of in front of us so me and Emily as other Emily which is Jamie's sister were walking first and the wedding planner that was in front of us that we could see mm-hmm. told us to go but the wedding planner behind us that was with Sophie was telling us not to go. So we were like, well, what the fuck do we do? We should just fucking go. I so got we told just off. went. I got told off because of oh, that. Sorry, you took the rap. <laughs> yeah, the we wedding got- planner came up to me and went, why are you going? And I was like, I don't know. I, don't know. <laughs> I was like, I am one. <laughs> Bye. Off I go. I was like this. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, the smile and wave. Just <laughs> I don't going. remember walking down. I don't remember like doing the walk. Do you? No, it's euphoric. It's all a blur. It was honestly like, euphoric. Poor Sophie must have really blacked out. I yeah. literally have no idea what happened. No. Before I know it, I got up there and like turned to t- tried to turn around to see her <laughs> and she was already like up on the stage. I was like, whoa, you were speedy. What the fuck? It was really just quite an intense moment for all of us. But then as soon as we sat down and then obviously the weather and everything like Sophie literally looked like she was like this fucking angel that come out from heaven like this the, this, the spray of like sunshine was just like setting on her face <laughs> and I was just like wow this is just like the most ridiculous moment I was like could this have gone like any better like re- how no, insane uh, unbelievable unbelievable the most beautiful bride I've it ever really seen it really was and that dress it was so beautiful such an amazing no it was absolutely incredible dress. and then actually getting in the taxis to, to go there we were literally like standing up like we were Kim Kardashian like didn't want to get creased and in we our were dress. going on our waist to Met Gala we were like stood up in the taxis because they do crease quite easily because yeah. I guess they're silk yeah and but then, we, we had Willis in our taxis it was oh Melissa my God, was myself and Willis hair. the hairstylist and we thought oh so he's been paid to do Sophie's and George's and um, their Sarah's mom. hair yeah not to do ours and we just, I was like oh was, I've got a little strand coming out here he went oh should we should we just touch that up and I went mm, go yes, on yes go on I gave you full on permission to do it and then I went go on touch me and I could tell he was itching to do something to my house like go on do it do it do it so we had like a mini zhuzh up in the car on the way which great. was stunning yeah, was really we good. arrived looking better than when we left like when we, when we left the house after the ceremony we came down and actually Sophie threw the bouquet as you do as tradition threw it past all the bridesmaids into the into the audience and was it Jamie's mum no, that no, she caught threw it, it she threw it into the pond <laughs> Jamie's mum had to fish it out of the pond and then Jamie's mum threw it to her own daughter I was like really not how it's supposed to go but okay I me and you that then Bye. Uh, I I need to get engaged to you it's immediately <laughs> throw it no to chance. me yeah, no chance. to be fair I kept my hands firmly down I wasn't even going to attempt to no, I wasn't it. either it was actually thrown kind of above me before it went into the, the pond Fox, you could have so just I, I could have jumped jump. but I don't know what it was I just stood there like <laughs> no, you was too nervous I was like no no it can't move <laughs> yeah, ah. can't look desperate <laughs> also we didn't rehearse the whole like and now I'll throw the bouquet otherwise no. we would have been like okay well we'll get ready to catch it then yeah <laughs> No one knew. No one knew it was happening. She just suddenly went whoop like that. I was like, "Whoa!" Warning What's going next on? time, please. Uh, yeah, into the pond it went. Um, then what happened? Then we all sat down for our dinner. Oh my god! And then you did, what was your? So didn't you tell me we all had these poems? Oh yeah. So the amazing tally from Pinky Studios. 
basically helped Jamie and Sophie write a little personalized poem for every single of the 180 plus guests that were there. Mm -hmm. How was yours? Did you... I was horrible. Like <laughs> Natalia, I'm pissed off with you, and I'm really pissed off with Sophie and Jamie. You know, it wasn't that bad. It was like, it was something like she's got a bitch face when she drinks or something else. Just like, what the fuck? And then Which is funny, but you were thinking Toby's really. Toby's was so nice. Toby's was like, you're the most beautiful angel boy I've ever seen. Or something <laughs> Love you so much. Want to be. <laughs> it was literally, should I read it out? Let me see Toby said. Toby Watkins, a real life. A real firecracker, the biggest sweetheart we've ever met. With his diamond chain, unreal good looks. Let's not forget. <laughs> you bitch Mine face. was horrible. I was like, Christ. <laughs> a bitch butt face. It just sounds like, sums up what my relationship is. Clearly with Sophie. I was like, thanks guys. Okay. Well, mine was really lovely. Oh, well, great. <laughs> mine was, I'm not even exaggerating. Me, I'm not even exaggerating. <laughs> <laughs> the sweetest, most kind and helpful angel she sent down from up above. <laughs> A social media whiz with the most contagious laugh, which we all love. <laughs> Sweet. Sorry, I actually need a copy to be sent to mine, sent to me now. Like, if anyone's listening to this that has my poem, can someone send it to me just so I can re, re like remember it? Relive the trauma. Yeah. I was like really upset that I was like taking photos. Like, oh, and I was like, I'm not taking photos of mine. It's horrible. I'm picturing everyone like around being like, oh, everyone's like, what's everyone was like, oh, um, what's your poems? It was. I can imagine you being like, look, going to look at me. <laughs> Oh, oh, don't know. I looked at Sophie and I was like, and I was like, showing her, I was like, bitch face. She's like, yeah. <laughs> she was quite close to me on the day. She's like, yeah. And I was like, is this meant to be funny? And she was like, yeah, you know. And I was like, no, I don't. But we're not going to have an argument now. It's a wedding day. I'll let you off. 